Hey guys, welcome back to Hermitcraft Season 7. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I just spent um a couple minutes. Couple minutes. Uh doing some things around in this about kind of air well, I mean, so behind you in front of why aren't you looking where I'm looking? Huh? Why aren't you looking where I'm looking? Come on, people. Jeez, work with me here. Um, so yeah. Um, I don't know if anybody's gonna notice anything different. I'm sure some will. Uh there's no longer any of that too tall grass. You know, and I was thinking about that. I was like, so it works whether you're typing T W O or T O O, right? It's too tall. <laughs> Either way, um, I'm going with the T-O-O -O tall. Uh, so it's too tall. Like, it's just, it's, there's no reason for it to be this tall. Okay? Just none. Um, this, obviously, there's some, some of it left here, but that's beside the point. Um, I went through as good as I could. There's, pro there, you know, there might be one or two. Actually, I see one right there. Um, like I say, there might be one or two in there and another one right there. Dang it. Dang it, man. Why isn't this perfection? Oh, yeah, it's me. Anyway, <laughs> let's go up here, get rid of this one. But I think it actually looks a lot better. And I was thinking about um, while I was uh, doing this because I got a bunch of grass. I did shear it. Um, I went through a few shears. I was thinking about like coming back through and then all the places where I took it out, replacing it. But if we come up this here kind of way and we look down, it looks good, right? Like it looks good. It, it's not super patchy like I thought it was going to be. Um, and I went ahead and rounded out this little bit of a deal here. Uh, just to, you know, like I said, I, I, I felt like it would be a bit more rounded here. I don't know. It, it works. I like it. Obviously, we need some grass and things up in here. Uh, I'm kind of still thinking about maybe trying to put a road in here or maybe even just a path coming up to here. Right? Because I feel like that would be a thing that they would do. And then maybe a path from, from the house up yonder way down up into this here kind of place. Right? I feel like that would definitely be a thing. But anyway... I think what I want to work on today is over in this here kind of area, right? We need a quote-unquote public uh, wine mashing thing. Like, we do have some in there, but I want, like, another building over here just to, you know, because why not? <laughs> is really the, the whole thing. Why not? We can. We will. Uh, it does mean more of this is coming out. Uh, this is what I, I intended to take some of this out anyway. Um, I'm not entirely sure what we're going to do back here. But, I mean, the building's not going to be this big. I think it's going to be... Well, let's just take a look here. All right, so I want it to come to about-ish... Here, let's mark it with diamond. Okay. So maybe from that deal to maybe that deal right there. I mean, that seems, depending on how you look at it, either seems big or it seems small, right? And then probably come back to about-ish right there. And then the same thing uh, over here. About there ish, I think. I feel like that's a pretty good size. And then out here we can have maybe just like a an eating area with like a few tables and you know, for people to have like lunch and tastings and and all that kind of stuff. Mashing tubs, I think, are gonna be on this side. And then this build the like the actual building will be here. So there'll be like a covered area thing here. And then, like I said, the tables and stuff over here. So they mash there, they come through, you know, they can wash and do all that and then come out over here and have some food. I feel like that's an idea. I have zero design for it right now. Uh, everything I said just now 
uh, I came up with just now. <laughs> so I'm hopefully going to come up with something at some point. All right, guys. So I've got a little bit of an idea in mind here uh, for this type of kind of sort of area. <laughs> type of kind of sort of area. I meant that. No, you're over there. Ha, hello. Hi, how you doing? Okay. Um, but yeah, I've got a little bit of an idea uh, of, of a build. And we're going to see how it fits in here. Um, I think I want this part here to be the front of... The, like, it might be a little bit close, but we can always push these little berry things back. I'm just trying to optimize the space up in here. Uh, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to tear these out. These here. And it's going to be... It's a little bit bigger than I had planned and a little bit different than I had planned. But I think it's going to be... I think it's going to be okay. Um, and I might actually take... I am. Yeah, this is all coming out. Uh, this side over here is probably going to be built up a little bit. All of this needs to go... I think it's a little bit bigger than I planned. It's, we'll have to see. Um, like what I have in mind is is it's it's one of those things. Like you never, you think of something, right? And then you go to build it, and then it turns out a little bit different than what you had thought. Just because you know you you got to tweak things as you go. Uh, otherwise, I feel like it's just not gonna work. So, let's see. Let's get this going across here. And then it's going to have to come up. And you see there's a little bit of a step here. So maybe we'll actually turn that into steps. It's it's going to be, like I said, a fairly long building. Okay. And then... Oh, and then. Oh, and then. Uh, this needs to come over here. Eh, something like that. Maybe like that. And then. Oh, snap. You, you you see what the things that are about to happen are going to blow your freaking mind or something. <laughs> so we're going to go like this. And then you can, I think, kind of see uh, what we're going for here. So it's going to be this kind of pattern going across here. This is kind of, this is a little bit of a pain to do, honestly. But I think it's going to work out really well in the end. Plus, Joe is, you know, Joe had this in other areas and it'll really match. Like if you guys look up at the at the retaining wall right there. So it just, you know, it kind of does a that way. And then if we come up here, you can see it's it's kind of there. This is the non-polished basalt, which I, I don't think it looks quite as good. Uh, but you can also see it's there, and then it's also down in the cave type area. But you can kind of see what we're... Look at that. That looks really cool. It looks really cool already, right? Right. Now, I have an idea. So, I think what we're going to do is we're going to grab out of here. We should have polished blackstone wall, blackstone wall, blackstone brick wall. And so we're going to put one of those deals there. And then somewhere, you know, like in here, we're going to have a few of these or whatever. And then on top of that, oh, I don't, I didn't bring it. <gasps> no. There we go. Aha. These. So bam. Maybe we go up like that. Right? Boom. And so this is going to be like, like a little bit of a, of a, of an area, right? little porch type area place and on top of that oh we're breaking out the big guns here people oh that's not something i can jump on top of what are you thinking aha oh yeah big guns bam look ah at that boom and done there you go hopefully you guys uh, are enjoying the build it's it look at it how could it be more perfect? You know what I'm saying? It's perfect. I enjoy it.
All right, so this is what we have so far. I'm digging it. It's looking pretty good. Uh, it definitely kind of ties together with that up there, as you can see. It's the same colors and, you know, all that kind of stuff. Same basic, you know, like, details and all of that. Uh, we've got this little wraparound porch. This is, there's more going to be here. Don't worry. It's not just going to be a big thing of campfires. It's, it's you know, it's a work in progress. Uh, but what we need to do is we need to figure out this ceiling, right? And so I want it to be like a, almost, almost like a barn, but not a barn kind of feel. So I'm thinking if we do something like that, and then we stagger it down, right? Something like that. And obviously we're gonna have an overhang. Now that's not really gonna work, is it? All right, so I think what we're gonna have to do is bring that up, bring that up, just so it kind of covers the, the thing there. Ooh, oh, nice, okay. And then if we continue staggering it, so this one would come there, right? I feel like that's a thing. Uh, yeah, because then it would, yeah, it would come down like that. And then that would just be like that, right? I feel like. <laughs> I feel like that's that's definitely a thing that happens. And you know. So I, I want like a little bit of an overhang kind of deal, you know? So like there's there's like a, a block like that. How's that gonna and I think what we should do here maybe we do some oh you son of a biscuit. Give me my pieces back, bruh. Yeah, so a little bit of an overhang kind of deal. I think it's going to look pretty nice. Okay, so we've, we've got this coming down, right? And then stairs, and then little overhang deal, and creeper. I feel like that's looking pretty good. Okay. I like it. I like it. So far, so good. Oh, you son of a biscuit. Get the fritter. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's get over here. We'll turn around, take a look, see how to. Ooh. I mean, obviously, once we get the stairs on either end over there, you, you can see it's a, it's a little dark, but that's fine. Oh, God, the creepers. Okay, the creepers didn't come over and cause a bad day just because that's what creepers do. Oh, I'm digging it so far, though. Now, an issue we might run into is what this ceiling, I think, because I want, like I said, I want it. I, I, well, actually, I don't know that I said I wanted it sloped, uh, but I definitely want it sloped. And so I think with an overhang, we're definitely going to run into this. Thankfully, if you have a silk touch pickaxe, <laughs> you could just pick up. Uh, the fire, the campfires, and not freaking lose them, like you know, because that would suck. And so, if we did, if we followed that pattern, this would come like that, and then the next one, yeah, see, like right there is where we're running into it. And so, this one's gonna have to come out. And so, if we did like that. And then same deal here-ish. You, you, you kind of get what I'm going for. It's like a slope thing, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so it's looking pretty dang good. I'm pretty friggin' happy with it. Um, I did push a couple of these rows back. Uh, so these are where it was. I just pushed it back one uh, just to make room for like a little bit of stuff coming down. But look at the feeling you get like when you're up in here. Like look at look at this, man. Like you're just looking out. You're just like, holy carp, man. This place is amazing. It's amazing. Okay. 
Um, I did carve out this hill. There's more void under here, apparently. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I'm going to figure out something to do with this. This this is not permanent, okay? This will... Don't worry, everybody, okay? It's fine. But I was looking at this area back here. It looks good, but I feel like it needs something right up in this kind of area general spot, right? So I think what we're going to do is maybe right about here. Well, actually, right about here is what I meant. <laughs> we're, we are going to put another um, another thing back here, but we're not going to put any bushes on it. Or uh, vines, I guess, is what it's su supposed to be. Um it's just going to be like a little seating area. Let's see how far out do we and it's going to be a little bit bigger than or a little bit deeper than the one out there. So you can see I made a bigger door back here because I was thinking about, you know, like this is the wine tasting area and all that kind of stuff. They've got a view of the freaking ocean. Okay? They're going to use it. <laughs> so it just makes sense that something would be back here. And so I think we're going to come over like this. And right about there. Okay. Something like that. Let's grab a couple of these here deals. Like a show. Like a show. And I feel like that's probably enough. We're definitely going to need to make some more of all the other stuff. Obviously. Oh, I didn't even show you. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> I completely, like, I took out all... Uh, all of the campfires and turn them. So the reason I did that is because if you look, uh, that's not a very good example. Is there a good example down here? Naha. Uh -huh. All right. So you see this guy here. It's just this straight beam all the way across, right? Is it that's the you know the illusion that it shows or gives or whatever? Um, and I thought this made more sense. Right? So you've got the straight beam going across as a support, and then the other one's going, you know, front to back. Right? Now, obviously, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense under here, but let's be honest. Um, campfires don't look all that great from the bottom. As they, you know, like, you're not even supposed to, like, you're not meant to see the bottom. Okay? Just calm down. <laughs> Just calm down, people. I'm telling you. It's fine. Uh, you? Do I have? I do. I don't need to fill it in, but we will. And then I think we're going to use the same... Same deal as the front. I freaking love it. Look at it. It's so cool. <laughs> I'm really digging this, man. Um, so I've been adding just a little bit of regular blackstone into the wall. Just to kind of change up the texture a little bit. Um, I went ahead, added stairs, and I even got the little deal right up on it. You can see I just slurped up a little bit of piece of dirt there. Um, yeah, just a little piece, you know, where the path comes up to another different type of block. Uh, you get that little, little teeny gap there where a different block shows through. But I thought this made sense uh, here, just this little connection. It's not a whole lot, and then I put a little bit of wall here. Um, I also switched out the wall. It was brick, and now it's just smooth. Um, I felt like that kind of made sense, too. Because why not? Um, but this wall's here, you know, liability. You don't want people falling off the edge there, right? Falling off the edge here. Here, it's even, so they could just kind of walk out. I just figured, you know, that it would be a thing as far as, like, liability and that kind of jazz Right? Actually, you know what? Let's put this one here. That kind of makes sense under, you know, the... Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, so did I decorate a fit? I just did that. Oh, I did it again. Oh, it's because that's the... Okay. Uh... No. You! Thank y'all. Okay. So, like I said, you know, just swapping some of these out so we get this kind of thing going on with just, like, the different kinds of blocks. 
Um, we got to figure out how that would be a thing. And then make it a thing. Like, maybe like that. And then a little bit of something like that. Right? Around the corners and stuff. Yeah. It's looking good. So I'm still not 100% sure on what this is. Like, I know wine tastings ha are going to happen here. But I'm thinking, like, we can make a wine tasting area here. And maybe a little bit of a, a restaurant-y kind of, you know, a couple tables and stuff. Nothing crazy. Just super simple, basic kind of stuff. And then maybe wine could be sold here. So you taste it over there. And then you're like, I want to buy it. And you come over here and you buy it. Maybe? We'll have to see how that goes. Anyway, I think... Actually, I know that's unfortunately going to have to do it for today. I just don't have any more time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. Hopefully you're enjoying the build. I think it really does add to the overall build. Like, look at that. Like, look at that. That's so freaking awesome, man. Oh, God. There's your fruit. You slow down and then turn around. Look at it. Like, just look at it. Oh, it's so good. 